Hi, people. My name is Kweku Anan, and I'm the host of the Seed Show on Netu Television. Uh, I think barely 24 hours to 48 hours. I have been bombarded with calls, messages, and many more. And from all places here in Ghana, and drawing my attention to a video recordings circulating on social media and other places, of which the video suggests that Anas Aramayo Anas has bribed Kweku Anan, the host of the seat show on Netu TV. Now, Ebusha for Enchewe Ubibeka so Kweku Enchempe who a here. Na diamant imede audio e eba bonte na mesra wonso no se unya audio ni bi nso a na wonso se we e fan of kwekwana na usu jitum se de ye ye bia ewo na tu tv eni de wonim kwekwana bia nso e fan hono cannot be described as that of what the news item or the story is purporting or to suggest <laughs> that that Anas Army Hamas <laughs> has come to give me a bribe to take a bribe. Now, minimisa ubiya ubinya audio in a utiria, two things would happen. Very much possible, say, sa story a bit today, three years nye. Ah, the atosumi, this story was also dealt with in 2017. And then this story got dead. So question I'll be this I want to say about the same in a 2020 quick one and much possible says Echo Chan Netu TV exposing fake pastors, prophets, and bishops in Ghana. Ubisi Makotam we or the Babe cast a slay against Kwekwanan's integrity. Is it Anas who is behind this? Or the fake pastors and the prophets behind this? Or together Anas and them doing this showdown? And the question, will this fly or it will not fly? Is this latest news or this is, call it belated news? Call it recycling. Call it dead news on arrival. Now, for the purposes of those who, for some reason, Munya Sa Anas story no ame year 2017, 2018, 2019. I did be do yes, 2019. Three years period. Munya the import of idea a course between many Anas. I guess these are the people who are calling on me to ask it where some are very much worried. So, could this video, if we hear by is it an old video or new video? And to, for the purposes of those of you, I mean to me and follow our story now and answer sir, as soon as I see between me and answer them. So, our video, it turns out it's a new video to you. But one more three years ago 2017 who witnessed the showdown between myself and anas arami anas sad story and you knew my own and to do one and open some more social media why you would see there a lot of the comments now a good video yes you know in the public brain add charlatans here almost just a video each on the say almost one of the big group one any mass no we don't see you did you want my temper to why because People have seen that no. Why is it that Kwekuanan and any boss Kennedy are compared with Japan? Are exposing fake pastors and then just around the corner, some charlatans, some shilly shally, cricky cranky human beings, be say, you kwa kofa a videotape, be Eddie Aba, Ebe Chiri, as I say, look at the Kwekuanan guy who sits on the net through TV portraying that he's exposing pastors. Now he's been caught taking bribe. We never who see we are here, but yeah, now see him. Is Anas Aramayo Anas 
has been exposed to the core he has been humiliated he has been disgraced he has been embarrassed and now I have for CCR or Ghana to the extent that nobody would want to buy him for anything not even the, you know Peswa to buy him for anything because when he started this journalism of entrapment journalism of call it subterfuge journalism of giving money to people and then he would take the best of short about people when the people are sitting there somewhere thinking about themselves now we also their mom you know in a pretext of say open saying any panini business was a day they would have video now they are bad one thing then anas becomes the first narrative to those video footages they will go for phone anymore say when i told him he said no he will not listen but i told anas he said listen to me anas whether you like it or not not the myth about you would be broken the myth about you would be demystified he thought it was a joke what is it that is about the video noir some of you might have cited it on the social media and i'll try to make my 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 delivery short in 2017 my platform on on one radio station called hot fm was contacted by i hear for our more east that they could upon chadu enclave that we should investigate something they want us to investigate something again let me tell listeners i am an investigative journalist and i'm also the ceo of hawk investigative company it's a private investigative company we do so many things like anas also says he owns tiger ipi or whatever it is i have we these chiefs were contacting you know, and almost say a brand tv on us a journalist or or we are on sassy including in sassy or matron town they are my private developers this guy is trying to take possession of this land yeah this journalist anas aramio anas and all terrorizing crawford in that area using police operatives military operatives and then land guards hey what's going on here well those of you who follow the story i will hot fm i'm assigned the banner too may attest to this that i have not changed my narrative and by any means announce i remain announce any co-host any copy of this audio this is what i want to tell anas that i am a man of consist consistency what i said some years ago is the same thing that i'm saying now so we went into this matter we call anas and we have the audio recordings of anas that we spoke to him about whether or not this accusation or allegation has you know bears some fact or truth anas spoke to us and said oh on also a quarter as i see when that i will be persuaded as a significant is not their court and a court in william and oh really i see long and short of it is this we started going deeper and deeper and as we go deeper the more we see different things that doesn't run you know in tandem with what anas has told us anas subsequently then said he's bringing his papers of he secured or having secured the land and or the court court anyway judgment or these are supposed judgments in the brain or a ruling but near my judgment here you'll find in true way all that i have to tell listeners and they say when a nurse realize that we are in seriously to investigate all his nefarious activities his wickedness he has perpetuated against people in his daddy go to Paul was overwhelming and i must again say to listeners and then some men are meeting a car and that's when fed up take lands belong to ministers you know powerful people in high places with the kind of name he think he has so he could use this to as it were go after their lands and some adore so i cannot mention their personalities because i don't have their permission now when a nurse and realizes say yeah yes i do you know yeah the first story me pia bunting then we have to pull off and go further in an investigations then we move to 2018 2018 Anas realized investigation now many make 
company no hawk investigative agency here you know we aren't through with him yet so then anas realized that no he has to find every means necessary to come after us and do anything possible to truncate what we are doing what then anas would have to do would be to now discredit the kukwanan guy who is investigating him around that time listeners let me be quick to point out say anas then was just almost about saying we read the investigative piece is all to the number 12 of kwesi entity so me were whole one time and uh, just reference about two weeks to say or did that documentary he will air the number 12 two weeks to it then a gentleman by name kinsley quartin of which of who which i can say this kinsley quartin the photo the pictures the photographs everything later we secured everything we had everything this gentleman by kinsley quartin called me and said hello mr annan my name is kinsley quartin and that i want to see you for a discussion and i'm saying oh really and i'm saying what is it about this gentleman said no he cannot narrate the story and that if, if it's possible to meet me in person and i said okay so i met this now listeners if you have seen a copy of the videos i don't know how many of them he has thrown out there but let me take you through all there is to the videos there are about three videos and us did as far as me and in his think agent you know obishi you know oh yeah now listen to it so this guy kinsley kwatin comes to meet me at afrikiko the first meeting was he narrates his story and his story was this oh uh, there is this uncle of his who is involved in the number 12 which is just a couple of weeks to come and that his uncle has gone to do some business with um what's the name um Kwesi Antichi. and the business amount involved is about 1 billion you know us dollars and that the documentary definitely would expose his uncle and that his uncle is the breadwinner and all of the honority story be brief now i am using this audio again that if anas rmi anas lives in ghana of, of of course which i know he's living here because for the past whatever nobody has traveled everybody's here and i am daring you anas as dirty as you are you think you can resurrect again and let me tell you you cannot use you know my platform the seat to resurrect i have already buried you right on the foot i told you that i will make sure you'll be demystified and then certainly you'll be uncovered now Ghanaians have seen that you are uncovered so you are trying again to use this platform to together with this fake pastors and prophet to launch yet another attack against the platform and my personality but i tell you what you aren't going to go through i am very resolute firm and great i am doing this audio for the purposes of those who did not listen to the expose we did on hot fm to expose you and that of when i also exposed you through visual audio visuals on the two that's why i'm doing this audio because the pressure is too much now when this kinsley quartin guy came i must say my uncle no i was her expose him and that Say expose me piano uncle no uh on my own breadwinner for honey years into the home a bet you says i'm saying look kwame king's look what his other name is kwame and i'm saying you know what i want to understand exactly the business are who uncle no on me question and teaching the coco here after the money you have mentioned said this was the amount involved but tell me exactly what it is and i'm here narrate me here analogy be man and say kwame take me as a lawyer if you if if you want a lawyer to solve your case for you you don't just go and tell the lawyer to just go and defend you in court even assuming that murder was the case you would have to tell the lawyer whether you knife the person or you took the person or whatever then the lawyer will be able to listen to you know we defend you properly i want to kiss the court and say only permission of his uncle to narrate the full story and that she's or contact and answer and i'm so okay then go back and tell your uncle that i am not i will not be prepared to as it were take the story until i get the full story but let, let me tell listeners why this guy came to me 
this guy Anas Esman Mane by because Anas already had picked a wind. So in 2017, I had started an investigation on him, of which Mifan said part one Krana Ababontia. And lots of people then knew say Anas Ayibibia, that platform on Hot FM, they are investigating him. And so now even though not on also the number 12 neighbor no? and last could see say he has to be more crafty enough to be able to walk me along his exposure and see quickly how he can you know get me down shut me down before his number 12 will come he calculated everything so many are brand in a castle we are and a brand is okay or call now all the events they may walk on aqua casa all right and to the next day and also frame and I see one and one for now, and that no offer. So I'm not going to me details. No, and I buy the second time we met at Afrikiko for the second time. So you see, Afrikiko this time, Kinsley Quartin, tell me exactly what what for no one question and teach you. And I say, no one for no any question and teach you. Business via our business, a uh, supply of sports equipment and sports hardware, and they involve uh, one billion dollars. Oh, really? So, apparently, uh, the supply of these goods have been done, but BB and Koye, and that their documents surrounding this contract has been leaked to Tiger Eye. And in Tinama Tiger Eye, for no person, Womu, a disgrace in the ankle. Nam Susa. I'm so still, it's even not convinced. And you are still not convincing me. And you know, at the end of the day, one can, as I said, me who on one casa. And I say, me uncle, no, or call hideout. Because they, are, they all sense that the documentary is just about hitting the screens into a call hideout. And to, oh, in about some few minutes, and uh, the supposed uncle, no, the call came on this guy's phone. And uh, offer, offer a call. Often also, uncle, hey, I'm here with Kukwan, and so if you can talk to him, and this isn't him, so okay. And I'll hand you over phone. So I'll hand you over phone in the moment. I'm in the supposed uncle now. And I'm going to tell you, listeners, who this supposed uncle is. And see, my name is uncle, and I said, I'm going to uncle, and I said, I'm going to tell you, and 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 i am going to tell you 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 to that extent of which you have been disgraced enough, you still want to resurrect by using my platform. Trust me, bro, you ain't gonna succeed. You are buried forever. Read my lips, and I'll make sure I will disgrace you until your last breath. I'm not gonna spend more time on you, but I have to do this audio for good people out there who believe in the true sense of journalism for God and country. That's why I'm doing this audio. But when he said we're exposing you, the last of you is yet to come. So many my uncle we kasere, and then my uncle so kweku. You know what? Uh, o company no how much in a mobile charging for all this work? Then I said, "Namu no, chief, my company is blah blah blah. You can go and check the company identity, baby. You know so you will know. But they see any mobile charging is saying, and I'm say, uncle, the thing is, unless nankasa no already no." We are doing an exposé on Anas on Hot FM. And also, go go. Ya timi na ewo me program so your friend Ghana must know. And again, listeners, you can go on Hot FM website or YouTube and click Ghana must know Anas exposed. Ubenya sa audio recordings in ewo YouTube. Ego for the purposes of verification. I want to tell Anas I am not a lazy journalist like him. Fake. You want to use this video to come and cast what? against my integrity and as you got it wrong you have failed again you have been disgraced and you continue to be disgraced and shame you have the mantra called a mantra saying what name and shame have you seen how you have been disgraced enough how you have been put to shame so uncle we 
the supposed uncle in me didn't come on we are not so so quick uh what do you know it's okay you know what uncle our company has the charges for all that we are doing now may be a documentary on anas or anas apart from what i'm doing on radio we are about to do a documentary and that the documentary it will be televised on all the television stations the documentary is not free no yes it's not free he knows that's what will be some charges i'm so okay i will communicate the charges you know, to the nephew you know, not their bro and what catch him say he has given something to this supposed the nephew or whatever and that the other man and yet the charges you know but a sign of a more commitment that they want to work with my company so or the bema i'm so okay no problem so this guy can sleep quietly remove this money and or the man you know say this is sika me me wafa say me from real say we are committed to them so okay then we left last meeting you could share with kempeski and now as i said oba abranti by any issue I'm so okay now i have to give you we have gone to speak to my team how much a better customer because i have already made an announcement let me say this to you, listeners my year announcement i will read you so i invite people who are interested in this documentary to come and help us sponsor it and he, yeah yes our announcement to one from him well known and this a whole person will buy forward now best sponsor documentary now why not now anas or any documentary now does he do it for free how much any bbc for the man or all those his allies and crooks who sponsored his number 12 including other investigations or why you know did he do it for free how much and a professor mills through uh, under auspices of professor mills umutu anas come and yes our documentary and you want me to do it for free this is anas's anas narrative really and you could share or not say no it's okay then i'm giving you the if anything the bill for come out Nafi, no ye radio, musumon fa musika mra because we are also talking to other interested stakeholders or we are interested in this documentary. In your home, a brand tiano this same kids requiring this time you could share or Kempeski or say no, ne wofa cry decided so time na bang in the end train na na se wofa ne documentary no on femra. If he brings his documentary, then you bring home all there is to the documentary so that we can also showcase ours and again listen so let me say this at that time this kinsley quarton had come to do two recordings of which one he has given me that money that his supposed uncle is on femra and his uncle now supposed uncle now, was not an, an uncle it was a nurse's right man who was shot dead ahmed swali who posed as the uncle and tonight and us, I'm to tell you, say, everything about what you did with Kinsley Quartin and Ahmed have been exposed. You rather made this Ahmed guy suffer casualty for no apparent reason, but it's unfortunate. So, at the Kemp Kempeski, Yeshia, this Kinsley Quartin guy came and I say, no uncle, I say, you're a documentary, no, a barrier. But I say, in order to say, I'm disappointed, I'm not going feel bad. My uncle said, we're coming for William Rowe. Now, still, believe that you have a sponsored documentary. So, our uh, friend is saying, a sign of your commitment, say, we still with you, say, we a documentary, and that we program that. So, uh, many times, this boy, when we are talking, he continue repeating, say, ah, I did my document ever saying, a program I hear you hot effing. I don't know. You have more things about Anas. You think P, you think P, and I'm saying, Kinsley, Yabotre. Everything that we are doing on Anas, we are doing it systematically. We have structured the story and we know how we'll go about everything. So don't push. Unknown to us, say, all these things that they were doing they were and as was using this boy to preempt all that we have on him to come out quickly before he brings his expose number 12. but i didn't succumb to their pressure say, we are doing this in series the one that will come on radio and then the one that will be in the documentary and at the end of the day on one who said no 
the Amokon, any Edma, into or this he can't man we also into a more call or catch and a wolf as well. This can't be empty, says he says, and the poor this boy left. I was there, my friends, after all these meetings transpired. Latest will be two weeks, no, not two weeks, latest will be some days. Anna, a friend of mine, called me and said, Kweku. Have you met a gentleman in recent times? I'm so yeah, a gentleman by name Kingsley Business is also, you know what? That meetings you, you had with the gentleman, a Yanas Nesumas boy. I'll tell you what. That meeting, they've had a recordings of you. And that they are bringing this recording outside on the social media and in fact ASA to tell a story about you having come to take a brand. Let me see me or bottom. What did what may you make juma? And you want to feed on my job. You want to feed on my documentary. You claim say oh Anna see do we in so so person be feed on me documentary of which a documentary that is coming on Anas. You want to feed on it. What about your mouth bill? Fiscal number one, fiscal number. What do commitment fee about Majiri? Who be drab on tie and narrative for for? As if this was like a movie to me. After this gentleman spoke to me, it was Saturday before that man would say Jack. First video has hit the social media. A mass army or mass could bravely enough put a different narrative to this whole footage, change everything. And I'm hitting no. social media say, Oh no, what about my bribe? Now, first of all, listeners, let me ask you a question How can a journalist like Kwekwanan is investigating a mass army or mass and then a mass could? Then decide that I am going to give this same guy bribe to do what? Stop the story? Do what to the story? And I told an Anas one time, say, as is he is not a sensible guy. What Anas should have done was to use a different journalist to come and even entrap me and say, Charlie, this, 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 this. But how can how come say one of me investigating you? You are the same person also here who did bribe Air Bremen. And do you think what you brought to me is bribe? Absolutely not. But of course, listeners, this is how Anas operates. With all that I've narrated to you guys, if anybody knows him and they will say, Are me away, Kwekwanan Ghana Opesa was I aired and wouldn't the stories about or see for original ones in the bribe. These are all fake videos. So quickly, and let me tell listeners, you see, Anas thought that his whatever he wants to expose on me. Kwekwanan is like one of those custom officers. Kwekwanan is like one of those uh, judges. Kwekwanan is like one of those civil servants for me to me go Unfortunately for him, I was also sitting on radio. So I could take my time, walk my listeners through this path that I have narrated here to them. And everybody who is very discerning could see and ask, you are a fake and a liar. I have not changed my narrative as a three years ago and today i will not change my narrative as if this was not enough for an ass or the video now babonte three years ago so whoever when you have video living on please i'll tell you don't waste your data to watch that video a hey, crap i see if this is not a oh, distributed video in our social media so every many people saw it and quickly i brought my explanation and the world could now listen and descend so no and ask you can't you can you can't fly with this as if this is not enough and now then wrote a letter to media commission say me me present a tarnishing image so media commission for an investigator yes he took me to media commission for about a month myself and Anas, we were you know going through this ordeal a media commission at media commission, Anas should come and tell the world what happened. I told the commissioner subsequent to all the meetings, I told the commissioner, I said, look, commissioner, we are already in camera. So Anas being the complainant cannot and should not and may not be allowed to have his face covered. Anas' face was smart. And these were the technical things that I use on him. I'm not a lawyer, but we are all smart and discerning. I told the commissioner, say, if Anas is the complainant. Then, by all, I am asking the question Anas being the persona, the human figure, or Anas the myth? Which is which? And who of the two can we describe to be that of the complainant? Anas the figure. Which is which? If he's the same person sitting there, then, Mr. Commissioner, I plea 
let that gentleman remove that rubbish eh then in him and the commissioners now if he they got alarmed and almost say okay well they are going they are going to discuss it and see whether they will uh, allow you know that mask to be removed or not it was adjourned the next we met then our last lawyer kisi jabin had written to the commissioner and said, No, Anas has been enjoying these privileges, dear and dear far in the years, you know. Apparently, the commissioner, you know, and so considered the same. Let me say, Look, well, lawyer Kisi, Kisi, Jabir, whatever, disgraceful lawyer, of his own, you go to media commission to complain about me, want to disgrace you, and you've given me money, so they should investigate me. Remove that thing, let me show you. Any catcher commissioner, and he said, Commissioner, for and say, Look, that complainant you know, cannot have his face covered and still want to pretend to be that of the Anasa, I know, because the gentleman who met me on that three consecutive, you know, is not the Anas. Of course, I've had my some working relationship with Crusading Guide in the 90s. So Anas is not somebody who I have to, you know, switch on a touchlight to watch his face. I know him so well. In the days of Peter Timu, Sedi Banza, and all those guys in Kwekubagun, Anas is one to tell me that today I don't know him. I'm crazy. Commissioners, if you're more trans, who say no, we're going on the tough lines. And I said, listen to me, Mr. Commissioner. Until you allow that boy to remove that rubbish, this case, you cannot continue. We cannot adjudicate it. And wherever it will go, I rather want an ass to go to court. Went to me and court. Eventually, I wrote a letter to the commission and I told the commission that with the greatest of respect if they will not allow or they will not allow my plea to also as it were pass through and admit it in the proceedings then i'm sorry this proceedings must come to an end and i'm not ready to you know follow again so subsequently commissioner i'm going tough then he suggested that i and anas should go to his office and remove my and Anas remove his face. And I said, Mr. Commissioner, with the greatest of respect to your commission, will commission and Kasama, it's already in camera. I cannot go with him into your bedroom or your office to go and remove anything. What is that for? Mani menim in presence of all the members of the commission. Osi Debi, and it all makwaya masad nisi. I'm so okay. So we makwaya masad nisi. Then, Mr. Commission, or whatever your name is, I'm sorry this should be the end of the road i will not cooperate with the commission neither i would subject myself to any dictate of the commission this is the end of the road and yeah sorry you're poor and then we walk away and that became the end of that media commission journey anas took me to so this has been the ordeal that anas aremi anas walked me through along the corner or along the line in 2017 when i opened the pandora box to go down with him and investigate him and expose anas this is what anas felt that he can do just to tarnish me and bring my image down but unfortunately for him it didn't work until listeners if you recall that in 2019 i had then come to net tv and then this time all the materials including videos of anna sitting in those videos and ordering his boys to be fixing cameras in corners and bring his victims in there give them money and video them and then later he used the video against them including felix yankopon the former managing director of unibank this is the boy called anna sarami anas wicked treachery a criminal a criminal extortionist and a blackmailer who today thinks that he can form an alliance with this fake pastors who be him and the rest and come at me again listeners let me assure everybody i am resolute firm grip nothing anas army anas will put on the surface of this earth that would you know he cannot will not and may not succeed it is not anywhere close at all and see so we'll be a when you have video when you be here they make a chance throw it into the dustbin and another propaganda they want to use it to confuse listeners but it will not fly we are not giving any credence to it today tomorrow no you know 
in attempt to usurping his negativity his evil treachery demonic things on Ghanaians today I can tell you Anas wanted to use this his demonic whatever as it were to usurping on government political you know top officials government officials including president at a point when he coughs everybody should go to bed but today and then nobody will go to bed because the length and breadth of him like as we say so the story is quite lengthy but this is just a brief summary i can give to my listeners and to so that will be who saw video near that one thing is a a video a yet sabi and kwasia same video any infasubia now me we